what is up Kilo crew and welcome to today's video. Today Randy and I are in the wee village of Portadown still where yesterday we just did that massive big old burger challenge with the colorful name but today we are heading to a place called Whipped and Cream where we're going to be taking on a two and a half kilo ice cream challenge that has only ever been defeated one time with seconds to spare. So uh we are trying to get ourselves hungry, walking towards the challenge, trying to warm ourselves up a bit as well, because it's a wee blessed three days. 15,000 steps old. Yeah, look at us just crushing it. But anyways, we will catch you guys at Whipped and Cream when the massive ice cream challenge arrives. So the massive whipped challenge has arrived here in front of me at Whipped and Cream and oh my goodness am I excited. All sorts of goodies are loaded into this whipped ice cream sundae and uh, I'm really looking forward to it especially after yesterday's super savory challenge. I've had a crazy sweet tooth that really needs to be fulfilled but anyways I'm going to have 30 minutes to finish all of this ice cream that you see in front of me. It is loaded with brownie bits. I got to pick some toppings which I'll go over in the voiceover and then also I got on the side here a nice lovely white chocolate chip cookie which I'm really really jazzed about. 30 minutes to finish all of this. If I win I do get the meal for free. I'm not sure if I get a groovy t-shirt or not. I'll need to double check. I will uh, confirm at the end of the video but I will get my name and photo up on the wall of fame. But as always, there ain't nothing to it but to do it. Let's pull our hair back and get this challenge started. Woo. Woo. Thank you. All right, this is melting quickly, so there's gonna be a whole lot of shutting up and eating. So one, two, three, let's get us a brain freeze. Woo. All right, thank you. Oh, that's delightful. Of course it's delightful. It's ice cream. When have you ever seen me say no to ice cream? Wow. Don't be fooled. It may be called whipped ice cream, but it was still pretty darn dense. Oh, that is double C thick, actually. Apparently, whipped ice cream has more fat and less sugar than its uh, traditional counterparts. That is so good. Don't worry, though. There was still plenty of sugar involved with the addition of caramel sauce, Kinder Bueno sauce, and Milky Bar sauce. There's a lot of kids looking at me with jealousy right now, but I don't think they'll look jealous when I'm done with this. Because I'm going to look probably pretty, uh, cold and discontent. Mmm. Is she the first woman to try? Mm. Um, you know, there was a couple of guys to try it, but there was a lot of ice cream spoons in. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I think the rice would be a lot Three spoonfuls in. We don't believe in quitting around here. I'm trying to imagine only getting three spoonfuls into a bowl of ice cream and then quitting on it. That is absolutely heartbreaking. Just imagine it there, all lonely and melting. So sad. I think I'll be going for a hot coffee after this. I don't know if it's possible or if it was in my head, but I feel like whipped ice cream was actually colder than traditional ice cream as well. Ooh, there's little bits of chocolate covered honeycomb in here that are real yummy. And of course, how could I forget, I also had added the chocolate covered honeycomb in there as well as crumbled Biscoff cookies. I'm gonna dedicate this video to my grandma who like cannot get a brain freeze and will polish off ice cream quicker than anyone you've ever seen. And she's in her 80s, so here's to you, grandma. Mm. She's a monster, I'm telling you. And that is a true story. She can make ice cream disappear like a darn magic trick. The brownie is so good. Not yet, surprisingly. Knock on wood, but there's no wood to knock on. No brain freeze, but my stomach was absolutely frozen solid. It felt darn near like the frozen tundra of Hoth. Uh, nerd alert. <laughs> Ooh, that's getting cold in the belly already. Cold! It was definitely a poor life decision to go into this food challenge wearing a t-shirt. I should have had some sort of sweater or jumper, as they say on, but hey, you live and you learn. <laughs> Whew, I'm trying to beat the stomach freeze to the finish here. Tough to do while you're lollygagging and enjoying yourself a bit too much. <laughs> the cookie will be my reward for finishing. I love white chocolate chip cookies. The brownies and the cookies were both made in house, so I knew that I had to go with the white chocolate chip cookie, which is always my number one option when I uh, see an array of cookies in front of me. All right, 
That's about it for the ice cream. Now I'm going to eat the cookie and then leave no doubt. That was a really good cookie, but it's also a very frozen cookie. Imagine that, a cookie being frozen after being submerged in ice cream. Dentists, cover your eyes. Hopefully there aren't too many dentists watching this video, but if there are, I am so sorry. Anyways, I'm going to leave you guys to enjoy the rest of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will, of course, catch you guys in the next one. Final bite of cookie, then we'll do some scrapey scrapey. Mmm. Mmm, maybe two bites of cookie. Mmm. Mmm. That was a great cookie. This is great ice cream. All right, we got the king of leave no doubt in here, so we'll do a little finger swipe just for good measure. Kids, don't play with your food. All right, what do you think, leave no doubt? I think it looks beautiful. All right. Wow. I gotta tell y'all, I was really nervous going into this challenge. I've never done a really big ice cream challenge officially before. <coughs> Excuse me. But wow, I'm really happy with that time. 10 minutes and three seconds to finish the whipped challenge here. Wow, that was good. Hopefully that makes more people confident to come in and try this challenge. Cause that was absolutely delicious. Super whipped. Love the toppings. I love like candy over like in this area. It's so good. Like y'all have milky bars, apparently chocolate covered honeycomb. Never tried that before, but anyways, for winning, I do get the 20 pound meal for free. And is there a t-shirt shirt or just the 20 pound meal for free? It's just for free. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. That's okay. We don't need any more shirts around here. Uh. And a spot up on the wall of fame here at Whipped and Cream. So a big thank you to Agni who came in today after having a baby four days ago. So congrats to her. What a champ. So let's hear it for Agni. <laughs> Whipped and Cream has been around for about three years now and started uh, in like a little shop around the way. And it is now in this really nice big building here. So congrats to them. But anyways thank you guys so much for watching big thank you to everyone who was here and cheered me on here in the little little town of portadown and uh yeah looking forward to another big old challenge tomorrow so thank you all for watching of course if you haven't already like this video subscribe if you haven't already and i will catch you in the next video okay peace out bye Woo. oh that was good thank you all